This was a big day for Gail Leach. He got out of his apartment for the first time in a month. A doctor's appointment. He has trouble breathing, so this machine helps. His heart's bad, so he takes fistful of pills. And some of this is paid for by the CanCare program. Leach believes it's the difference between having his own apartment here and going to a nursing home. I'm so thankful to be here. I'm happy in this apartment. I've been here for years. But Kansas has cut some elderly benefits by a third or more, and Leach worries if he's next. I don't know what the status of that's going to be this coming year. Recently, the Secretary of Aging in Kansas, Tim Keck, wrote an article saying things were good and growing. Johnson County's experts wrote back saying the situation's getting worse. Dan Goodman talked about the story of a young disabled woman whose caseworker called her mom to check in. She contacted the elderly mother to schedule her reassessment and find the, the mother communicated that she'd been uh, deceased for nine months. So that's Gail's story. As you can see, he is on support right now, but as you also see, he's very worried about the future. I'm Michael Mahoney.